never faced a Cardinals team before today. And Wilson gets into one out the left. Vasquez back at the track at the wall. Gone! Over the berm and onto the concourse for Jacob Wilson. He regains the team lead in home runs with 14. RBI number 62. He got a first pitch he, to his liking and just lost it out to left field. Over the berm and onto the back end of the concourse. And the Chiefs lead 1-0. 14 is lifted into left field. That ball is down a base hit. Wisdom will be sent home, heading for third. Now throwing on the brakes is Valera, and he is out, going back to second. Chiefs do get a run as Wisdom scores, but Valera, non-committal on the base pass, is out as they throw behind him in second. Seawolf skipper in the 3-0, he walked in a run. Third walk of the inning. Let's see if now we'll get a visit from Jason Simon Tachi. The Chiefs coaches have not been out to talk to Garcia yet as he is throwing eight straight out of the strike zone. 12 of the last. Brings it home and it's lined into left field of base hit. That'll tie the game. The throw comes to third. And it's 2-2. On the way. Steads another throw over, and McElroy's back in, and the ball gets away. This will bring home Vargas. McElroy is going to stop at second, and it's 5-3. Pitch on the way. is lifted out towards shallow center. Coming on, Harrell. He will get there to make the catch. Throw lob back in. Coming home now is Valera. He'll score. It's 5-4. That'll be an E8 on the lob in by Harrell. And it's a 5-4 ball game. Pitch on the way. It's hit on the ground towards first base. The pitcher will pick it up, step on the bag, and the ball game is over. Chiefs fall 5-4. Ryan Pierce will have the postgame show for you after this on the Peoria Chiefs Radio Network.